welcome to Badger Beer. <laughs> <laughs> An AC student media funded program. I <laughs> What's going on? I messed up, but who cares? <laughs> Today I have... Jeannie Barcroft. Hey. How do you say your last name? Barcroft. Bar. Where are you Croft. from? Well, I mean, I'm from here, but it's a German last name. Anyway, let's get to the, the show. The reason why you guys are here. Badger BS. One of the greatest shows, Snow to Amarillo. Hosted by me, your favorite guest, Ocho. The favorite one here, Jeannie. She's okay. representing Badger Hearts. Tell us a little bit about Badger Hearts. Okay, so Badger Hearts, it's a nonprofit um, group on um, on the AC campus, and we just basically we raise all this money to help the foster kids that are aging out of the system. So, because once you turn 18, you're kind of on your own, and not everybody mm -hmm. has the money. So that's where we come into play. All right, cool. Well, it's a pretty cool program. I shake this up. Give it a little shake right around. You These are questions, right? Yeah. You, you can shake it. I feel like Taylor Swift, you know. Shake it off. Shake it off. See, I like no? Taylor Swift, but you're not doing her justice. I like T-Swift. What's your favorite song by her? Um, probably Love Story. Is that the title of it? I don't know. It's like her, from her country era. Oh, I didn't, I did not listen. Oh, wait, you pick a question first. Do I ask you? No, you read it out loud and then you answer it. Oh, I have to answer it? Yeah. Okay. You never watched a Badger BS episode, huh? Well, I've watched one. Mm. But um, if you could live anywhere, <laughs> where would it be? Uh, Seattle. Why Seattle? Seattle's gorgeous. I saw it on Twilight. Okay. Um, I like that. It's beautiful. Uh, I probably live in, like, San Antonio or something. I just... Why do you like, want to stay in Texas? Because I love Texas. No, you don't. Texas, yes, I do. Leave Texas. Again. I don't want to leave Texas. I mean, I would probably go to Colorado because it's it's really pretty. See, I just want to move to Colorado. a more scenic view. Okay. I don't know. I just like Texas and the River Walk, and, and the River Walk is really pretty too. Have you ever seen Twilight? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's insane. Have you ever seen Twilight? Yes. <laughs> what about you, director? You ever seen? Dang, so you don't know I'm any sorry. I mean, well, like, I've seen, like, posters and shirts and nah, stuff, but I've never been like into Twilight or Twilight Vampire is, Diaries not a good, or anything like it's not that. A good, it's not a good series. I'm not going to lie to you. The movie's not good. But the scenery in those movies, mwah, fabulousimo. That's probably, did I say it right? Fabulousimo? Capiche? Fabuloso? Yeah. Next question. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so. But is it filmed in Seattle? Is that what you're talking about? It's filmed in Oregon, Sonia. Oh. What's your favorite thing about fall? Women and leggings. <laughs> <laughs> what about you? Um. I could say guys in sweatpants and go off of the women in leggings. <laughs> Because it's but it would probably be um, sweatshirts. I uh, love sweatshirts, like hoodies. Have you ever had a boyfriend? Yes. Did you steal his hoodies? Well, I mean, I didn't or necessarily steal them, but borrowed them. Have you given them back? Yeah. Uh, like, I don't want it anymore if, if we're not together. No, a lot of women. No, I, mean, I just think that's weird. They just steal them and sniff them. Sniff them. That, Women yeah, see, that's are weird. weird. Yeah. Women are a little weird. Glad I'm not one. Just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <clears throat> what do you think about fidget spinners? Well. Well, guys. He has one. I just one. got one yesterday. <laughs> I know my cousins oh. love them. I see them everywhere. And I know they're made for a purpose, but they're pretty fun. I I've never look. owned one. What's the purpose of this? Isn't at, it's like ADHD or like attention? It's just it's like something to help people focus. This doesn't really help sure me focus. I, I just spin it and talk oh. to people. Well, people are like sounds, really fidgety. It gives them something to do while yeah. they're trying to maintain their focus. Ah, now the name makes sense. Right? Fidget. Ha <laughs> ha. You know, I never put that together until you literally just said something. Fidgety. Yeah. We both learning stuff on Bad BS. I'm learning a lot today. All right, let's get another question. How many more questions are in here? 
one Are we more. answering all of them? Yeah, we might. Wait, there's three more. We might answer all of Let's do it. What is your favorite cheese? Havarti. What kind of cheese is that? I don't know. It, I got it from Walmart and it was expensive, so I liked it. Mm. So are you rich? Hell no. Heck. Heck no. Ask it again. Are you rich? No. Super poor. <laughs> <laughs> what is your favorite cheese? Um, well, I'm pretty cheesy, so I like a lot of cheese. But um, this one time, I had what kind of? I, I, I think it was goat cheese with like pecans, because it was like the crunchiness of a pecan and then like the softness of the cheese because it was like chunky cheese. It was so good, and I think goat cheese is my favorite cheese. Pecans just throw it all off. Mm -mm, because Did you, you have, have it the, on a sandwich, or were you just eating cheese by itself? Just eating cheese and pecans. It was really good. You do that? No, it, it it was feta oh. cheese because. It stunk really bad. It was like really stinky cheese, but I don't think, I don't think, think it was goat cheese. That's, that's definitely not feta. I don't know what kind of cheese it was, but it was good, like soft cheese, and then the mm. pecans were crunchy. Was it white? Yes. It was white cheese. Okay. No, I don't know which one you're talking about. I don't know. It was really good, though. I like, and put my fidget spinner down. I like uh, Blue Nester, Blue Nester, I don't know. Never it's it's nice. Cheese. All right. You know, um, mm -hmm. last year in speech, I actually did a a speech over cheese. I really did. I, for my speech class, I wrote a speech over how to make a sandwich, and I got an A for it. There are more. And that teacher doesn't work here anymore. <laughs> <laughs> what is your favorite drink from Starbucks? Be specific. I don't go to Starbucks because I feel like it is an establishment that was created to keep the people down with sugar highs. Okay, sugar well, lows. I, for one, absolutely love coffee. But I'm 100% a roasters girl. I love roasters. But oh, um, at Starbucks, I get my roasters order. It's never as good. But it's a grande caramel vanilla latte with an extra shot. Of what? Of espresso. That's just how I order it. I don't really know what it is, but I know uh, it's really good. Just ask for the shot. <laughs> mm -hmm, an extra shot. No, I, um, when I go to the 806, they have this one very specific drink that I can't say on air. I know exactly what you're talking about. It is so the good. star. It is sweet. It tastes like hazelnuts or something. Mm -hmm. Wait, and we might as well knock out all these questions. I was questions. like, oh, okay. We're relying on you guys to refill these questions back up. Oh, wait, this is your question. Oh, I didn't this read is it. me. I opened it though. If you were a color, what color would you be? <laughs> <laughs> if I was a color. <laughs> Um, <laughs> I would probably be uh, like a salmon color, like that salmon color, like some people call it orange, pink, whatever, I don't know, but I just look really good in that color, so that's the no, color. No, it's not I asking be. you what color but, you would look but good. But I mean, if I look good in that color, why would I not be that color? Because you would look weird. But then I wouldn't wear that color. Oh, you're right. Yeah, um, I'm like, this is the color that your skin's going to be. I'm picking green regardless. Because I can be like Jim Carrey in a mask and just wear yellow suits all day. Like, I, I don't know. know. I'd probably be like tie-dye because mm -hmm. I like to be tie-dye. You know like that one girl in the book where she ate like those lima beans and she turned like all the stripes colors. It's a children's book and I can't think of what it's called. But because she was sick and she was like all these different colors. I on the cover, know. she has like a thermometer in her mouth and like was an ice pack on her head. No, I think it was black. No, I don't but um, she was no, like no. these striped colors. It's a children's book. Never heard of it. Nah, it's time to get to the lava lamps. Oh, You're yeah, right. let's, let's do, do the lava one lamps. question. Oh. Wait, I'm going to let you pick from these five questions because those, that's all that's left. So just pick one so like, that you think would be the, the best. The at the front. Describe your perfect date. Well, you know, um, you got to change, change your voice for it. Be like one of those. Uh, <laughs> What is it? I'm really not good with accents. It? Have you seen Hotline Bling? Dang. Have you seen Hotline Bling? Yeah. What are, what are those? Cell phone? No, but it's like a call center where women, where you call them, and they'll be like, hey, what you got on? Like, oh. You want me to sound like that? Yeah, when you're describing your perfect date. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> I 
Well, I was going to say something like October 7th, 2014. Oh, get go it? Ahead, go. Oh, I was just kidding. But, um. Why? <clears throat> I don't know. Okay. Hello. Are you really going to do it? <laughs> Did you not want me to? No, it was fine. Okay, good. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I'm a pretty basic person, so I just like, like, I like to go out to eat and then just like watch a movie. Yeah, and chill. Yeah. But that's like a first date thing. And then like other dates, like we could just drive around and eat some ice cream or some frozen yogurt because I love Froyo. I love Froyo. Shout out to Orange Leaf. And then, um, was good. you know, no, there was this one place that was called Just Chillin'. It was like on 34th and Bell and they had like the chocolate covered sunflower seeds. Those were my favorite, like. Best frozen yogurt. I'm not gonna lie, you're pretty weird. The best. I like, don't care. Stinky cheese. And I do like. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. Sunflower seeds. Yeah, like I'll buy them. Like you can buy them at Hobby Lobby or Cracker Barrel, and I just, I eat. Never them. went to Cracker Barrel. You've never been to Cracker Barrel? Really? Something about that place that's just like. <sighs> I mean, well, I worked there for like two years. So no. okay. Anyway, my perfect <laughs> date, um, probably just something basic, and then you know we can just do stuff, just different stuff. I don't know, I just like to be spontaneous and basic, and I like anything. Aww. So, fellas, specifically the one that does that thing that she knows about, you know who I'm talking about. We were just talking about him upstairs. That your, does that thing? Your crush. Oh, my God, okay. okay. Yeah. Get at her. Wave at him. Yeah. <sighs> Okay, anyway, I'm not going to de describe my perfect date, but I am going to describe the date that I'm taking a very special lady. <laughs> oh. we're, we're going um, ice skating, and then we're going, where? We're going to this pottery place that's on Wolfland, and then we're going, we're probably going to go to my place and cook, but we probably go to her place and cook, because I don't want her to be like, oh, he's just trying to get me back to my, his place, so he can have his room. I'm not. What's a pottery place? Huh? Pottery? Oh, pottery. Yeah. I thought you said like, no, like no, powder. No. I was like, what are you talking no, about? There's some That's cute. Yeah. I like ice skating. That's fun. I've never done it. I like rollerblading too. It's Have it. you ever rollerbladed? Is that the one with the four wheels or one? The four in a line. I've tried it. I yeah. feel. It's exactly <laughs> like that. It's, it's a lot of fun. No, sh we're going to talk about this on another episode <laughs> because we got to wrap it up. But let's show y'all the cool. I'm so sorry. <laughs> The lid's <laughs> on. <laughs> All right. See, I told you I like So today, roasters. we're going to teach you guys how to make lava lamps. Wait, what is this? Glitter. It's the glitter. It was in the way. Oh. All right, so pretty simple, to be honest. You get a bottle, you fill it up about three-fourths of the way with vegetable oil or mineral oil, whichever. Then you fill the rest of it up with water, like ours are. You see how cool this looks? Now we're going to add. Stand up. Yeah, but we, we can't stand up too. We can't stand up. <laughs> oh, we can't stand up? No, because it's going to cut off our head. Because oh. I was trying. Yeah. Wish. I can just edit that out. OK, so you remember the video, right? Did they say add the glitter? No, they said add the It was a food color. Yeah. I'm gonna do purple, so I'm gonna add these primary colors I'm together. I'm adding green because I really like them. Yeah, I figure your, your fidget spinner's green. No, that's the color that all of the fidget spinners How many are you doing? They said seven drops, oh. but I'm gonna add more. There we go. Okay, I did eight red, let me do eight blue. I hope this mixes together. <laughs> and then we add the green glitter. I don't even know how it's going to mix together for you. <laughs> Yours are just going to be red and blue. That's cool. Yeah. And green. <gasps> what? I got on my fingers. Well, that's what happens when you're dealing with arts and craft. Hey, try not to spill this glitter, though, because someone told me something in a group chat earlier that I can't repeat on camera. I feel like that's too much glitter, but. Well, it's a big bottle. Yeah. It's a glass bottle, I thought it was plastic. Fancy. What? My bottle is plastic. No, it's glass. Oh, that. And then you, sh you, you shake it up. Shake it off. Players gonna play, 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 play. 
fake, it's gonna fake. Oh, it's fake. oh, it mixed. Oh, that looks very regular blue. <laughs> it does not look blue. You, yeah, yours is totally green. I feel like I did this wrong. I have no idea how, but this is definitely wrong. Mine looks black, but then it looks blue at the top. Wait, this isn't right. <laughs> well, it's because you did green on green. No, 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 no. That's not that. Because we should still be able to see. Like mine? Yeah, I guess. Maybe you didn't yes, add enough food should, coloring. No, nah, it should still be separated on top. It is separated. Yeah, but mine isn't. It's just like, <laughs> mine just mixed up like it was <laughs> Kool-Aid or something. Well. That's how you make a lava lamp. Nah. It actually looks really cool. Yeah, yours does. Mine. <laughs> Look at this. It's, it's a bottle of green slushy juice. Don't drink it. I'm not. Thank you. Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> no. Oh, well, so how you like that. this? You gonna take this home and hang it up on a wall or something? Actually, no. I was gonna give it to my best friend. Who is your best friend? Karina. Not Stevie Brickshaw. For shears? She's one of my best friends. You can't have one but best friend. Yes. Oh my gosh. You can have I mean, more than one best friend. Like, I have one, two, three, three of like, my best friends. Are they all equal or do you favor? No, they're not equal. Oh, okay. Just making sure. It's like having kids. I mean, you, you say that they're equal, but they're not equal. Very true. Very, very true. You're an only child. You don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but that's all for our episode. You can catch her at, what's your Twitter handle? I actually don't have a Twitter. What's your, yeah. I have an Instagram. Oh, it's Jeannie, Jeannie Lynn. <laughs> it's Jeannie Lynn. Is that your last name? No, that's my middle name. Okay. Or you can catch me at the acranger.com. <laughs> oh, I gave y'all my real Instagram. I didn't know it was like supposed to be like a business. No. Instagram. No. Nah. <laughs> no, nah, you can give out your Instagram. Nobody's going to care. Okay. Because. I, I mean, it's all private, so. They're going to follow you, and I hope that one guy. Yeah, but I have you. to accept it. He's going to follow you, and you're going to be in love, and it's going to be so adorable. Yeah. You don't know that. He yes, probably I just do. told you that. See you guys. We have stuff to talk about on camera. Oh, yes. Off camera, I mean. <laughs> Try this at home. No, don't. This yes, is a waste of really, money. No, don't do this. I, I spent eight dollars and twenty-four <laughs> cents on this. I just had to had to buy the water and drink it, so. This is so disappointing. It looks so cool in the video too. Mine has too many bubbles in it. I'm Madison, turn us off so I can start cussing. <laughs>